School is not so important. It's not a necessity anymore. The first reason is that we are no more in the industrial era, industrial age where factories have been built and therefore we need workers, uh, workers who just enter into the factories and produce things and those days have passed. It's no more the case. We are in the, the information is everywhere, especially on the internet. Information is everywhere. People could get it, you see, and it's being given, doted out freely. So there's no case that you have to be in a formalized um, environment. You have to be in a, an enclosure to, to learn or to, to gain new skills. And this is the reason why, this is the first reason why I believe school is no more necessary. Come on. And, and therefore, we will require, it will require creativity. But here's the case, you go to school and your creativity is stifled. People who have creative way of thinking, have innovative minds, are blocked. They, they are rather taught that uh, they are seen as deviant and the, their abilities are suppressed. Tender age. I feel school is no more necessary. School is no more important. School has rather become the devil that uh, falls the, the potence of the creative spirit of humanity it has it has weakened people's ability to think critically and so i don't i don't feel that there is the need to ever enter the school again uh, well it's this period i'm talking particularly about this period so no, nobody should come confuse what i'm saying with um earlier times or the coming future now in this 21st century information era i don't believe school is important the thing is that um School is supposed to provide discipline, it's supposed to provide focus. But currently we are seeing that discipline and focus is becoming the last the last goal of any school. If you, you see private schools focusing on profit, focusing on trying to please uh, the, the government, the incumbent government or uh, po political political masters. So don't we don't find that discipline. Another thing too I, I, I see is that a school situation is supposed to be a place where it is nourishing. You find good people, uh, happy people, ready to have to others. But you find a situation whereby those who are dishing out the information, dishing out the skills, dishing out the information that they have, are becoming a bit unhappy. You find a group of people who are happy. You find teachers as a group of people who are, who are never really happy with their situation because they have been cheated. They have been cheated in several ways. Cheated in uh, their, their pay increment. They, are, they are cheated in the amount of money they are paid. Even people can get recruited and paid long after. They, they're not paid at once. Teachers, you find teachers suffering because they, they, are not, they are never appreciated as much as possible, as much as other uh, civil servants or as much, much as other middle class people so I believe this situation is not making education uh, in schools so so important schools stifle independent thinking school has become a place where everyone has to think the same way uh, have people have to conform to a particular norm and when we all conform to a particular norm, then you know that creativity is no more, independent thinking is no more. And when there is no independent thinking, then things, things, things will just go haywire and everybody become like robot. The more we become like robot, then the life itself will not become better because we need diversity at certain times, we need a bit of chaos, we need a bit, bit of uh, thinking against the norm which would improve things. Because where people people are not uh, challenged, those who are in power, those who have knowledge, are not challenged by new things, by new people's perspective, then what what will happen will be that this is what tend to think that they, they are the all in all, and which will help in development. Thank you.